Let's let's get going. I the last thing I need to do is get through less of the game for all of you <laughs> due to this, but but I hope everyone else is doing all right. I hope everyone else has been surviving the heat. Yes, we are Alan. We are here. We need to get to our next gig. We're doing this for you. That's right. Casey got infested with the darkness instead of me. Y'all, you're doing what? forced to watch. The dark presence held all the cards now. My boys. My boys, really? Okay, well. Where the fuck did Saga go? Alright. Alright. Anyway. I hope everyone else managed to survive the weekend uh, a little better than. I did, perhaps. I, um... I think I took three showers yesterday. Short showers, but... All of them just being, hey, I'm really sweaty and hot, so I'm just gonna Welcome run back. cold water on myself. You are awake now, right? With the shadow out of you? Luckily, water is included in my unit, so that doesn't that cost me anything, situation this fucked since the so to speak. WWE in Eagle River. The shadow's now in Alex, and Anderson is gone. We need to figure out how to salvage this. Yeah, what happened to Anderson? Anything it takes to fix this, Agent Estevez. I'm the reason you got some mild heat stroke heat sickness on Saturday. I'm ah, geez. But I should have put you in a box and shipped you off to a containment facility the second I laid eyes on you. The only question now is... Are you able to fix this? <clears throat> Went somewhere that was supposed to be mid-80s, but it was actually 91. Was Yikes. Answer, but we'll make it work. I think for the most part, we were at, like... Let me do the math in my head real quick. I was mostly around 95... But yesterday, in fact, I don't even know what the temperature is today. Because today, the one good thing about being back at work, we have a very good air conditioner at my bank. Uh, yeah, we're up to 38. So ye yesterday and today, we're, we got up to like 37, 38, which is basically 100. Uh, not including humidity, which always Gross. sucks shit. The dark presence inside but hence, why I'm just sweating. Into the lake. And I slept super place, bad all weekend because I just, it took me you know, years to being out. gross and sweaty all she night, too warm all night. Odin went in after her, right? Maybe they'll get her out with the power of rock and roll. I saw them when I was trapped there. They performed in my musical. I'm immediately less optimistic about this. What's the situation? I've never seen an entity break a bureau containment unit like that. And now the dark presence is occupying... Yeah, that is pretty nuts. It had the whole light thing on it and everything. When it attacked him in the woods, it must have been preparing for this. And now he has the clicker. Scratch will go to Bright Falls and use the clicker to bring about the horrific ending he wrote for Return. But I can still fix this. How? Scratch must have the manuscript. If I can read mm -hmm, the ending, mm -hmm. I can rewrite it. I need to go after him. Well, you won't get very far without these. This plan is a real Hail Mary wake. I wish I could help. This is all on you. Yeah, that leg is pretty that fucked up, huh? kind of weapon we have available. Don't fuck it up. All right, I'll try. I'll try not to fuck it up. The car. The FBI vehicle would be at the parking lot. It's not a lot of ammo. Okay, that's better. Free ammo, thank you very much. So what, do I have Mind Palace still? No, I do not have Mind Palace. Or I guess Writer's Room for Wake. All right, well. So other than being way too hot, what all did people spend their weekend doing? I, for one, 
uh, spent a whole lot of time. I have so many shotgun shells. How did this happen? Holy crap. Uh, I don't think I need these. I'd rather have that. Okay. Pills. I have pills. Why do I just, like, barely have any handgun ammo? There's no handgun ammo in any of these crates? Playing FF14. Oh, you're back on the 14 train. <laughs> new expansion. That's right. I do have a friend, another couple of friends talking about the new expansion coming out. I had kind of forgotten. Not exactly surprisingly, I don't play the game. Though I did spend a bunch of my weekend playing uh, that that new gotcha game, the the Zenless Zone Zero. In part because I had promised uh, a certain co-host wait where which fucking direction am i going here I need to get to the parking lot can i go under the log next to you yes okay i was awake again clear-headed for the first time in what felt like a lifetime i was back exactly where i left a dark forest outside bright falls a gun in, in a hand, long time, my guy. A flashlight in the other. Haunted by my own writing. Alice taken from me. I knew what I had to do. Stop the horror story from coming true. Stop the dark presence. We're gonna try. But yeah, uh... You know, I'd, I'd seen a little bit of advertising for Zenless Zone Zero. I feel like they showed it a couple years ago at this point and was like... Oh, they're making, like, an action game. Maybe I will check that out when it comes out. And I combine that, for those of you who listen to Matt and I's podcast for God knows how long. You may recall that Matt plays... My guy, really? Matt plays a bit of the Genshin Impact... that and one of the things they always said about Genshin Impact was like they like it a lot but trying to get into that game uh now after the years of that game being out and since it's a gotcha game and everything even though they're always running events to try to get new people it never feels like you can really get into it at this point at least that's the way matt has tended to to talk about it which is why i had said when zenless zone zero comes out i'm going to get in ground floor on that game i promise i'll check it out my guy how do you not get freaking stunned by giant shotgun in your weak point Absolutely ludicrous. Oh, that only got one. Heck. My buttons are confused. Oh, hang on. <clears throat> okay. Gotta get my buttons back. Hang on, chat. 
But yes. Uh, so that game came out, I guess, last Wednesday, actually. Like, Wednesday evening it was playable. So I have been doing my daily logins and getting my bonus pulls or whatever you want to call them for that game. And I must say, while I am having fun with that game, uh, it starts real bad. It took a chunk of hours before it started giving me enough, like, hey, here are things you can do or things you might want to engage with uh, for it to start feeling worth it. What if I... God, I wish... Wait, like, didn't you have another set of... Being able to hold shit... In the other world? Very annoying. Jesus, there's a lot of them. I dodged early. That was my bad. more than two more. What the heck? Where are y'all coming from? Dodge towards them. Gotta remember to dodge towards them, not away. Works much better. Ay 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 ay. Never go through this door, huh? Hmm. But yeah, Zumblestone Zero. I've been I've been enjoying it a bit. Once once stuff started kind of unlocking, and I felt like I could. Frankly, the the piece that's maybe like the most surprising about it is in the dark place. The dark presence. Oh, hold on. Into me. When I was pulled back here, crossing over weakened it. In uh -huh. dormant. I couldn't remember what had happened, but I could feel it getting stronger, waking up. I thought it was hunting me, closing in. It was inside me the whole time, and then it took over, turned me into scratch. Yep, inside you the whole time, my guy. The, the piece of the game that in many ways feels like the most like what I expected out of the game didn't unlock until like account level 20 or something. Which the way the game is set up, you can fucking level up goddamn everything and they all have 
different currencies for leveling up that you're earning and it's it's a gotch game what do you expect but uh you have like an account level and then all your characters have their own level and stuff and the account level is like what a lot of stuff is gated behind for like hey what are activities i can do and there's just a lot of stuff that feels like it's gated a little bit further back than I feel like it should be. Or further up, I guess, up in level. Which which really makes like starting the game out and, and getting going kind of feel pretty bad. The first like three or four hours, frankly, is like kind of a slog. Like a real slog. I but you know. Get to Bright Falls. See this through to the end. Once I got past past a bunch of that bit, it it, it kind of got me into the game proper, and I'm, I'm having a lot more fun with it. Kind of gating associated with gotchas is why you have so little interest in them. Yeah, I will say like I put zero money into it, and I have uh, done a lot of roles and like had a lot of story to help me escape. There's plenty for me to do in it now. Cost her everything. Alex Casey in my writing for years. Which in one sense is good. Like maybe maybe it's Now he was a victim too. Hang on. Saga, Casey, Alice, all this horror originates from me. Uh-huh. It's my fault. Scratch had to be stopped. We just got to watch uh Alan go down another depression spiral really quick. Okay. Um. I haven't put any money in. Ah, oh, fuck. He's not done talking. <laughs> in 2010, I dived in. A leap of faith for Alice. With no idea that the cost would be a nightmare worse than death. It had taken me 13 years to get out. Was dead because of me, and I was gonna make that leap again. This time, knowing the cost all too well. And then you're gonna make a phone call to yourself, talking about getting out but going back in, right? Another way to look at it, I had brought the dark place here with me. I never had gotten out. Maybe after this, I finally could. It was a fool's hope. I had no choice. I had to do it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That didn't make me any less terrified. Fuck it. Maybe it's only an overlap this time, Alan. It's bright. It's bright falls. It's not dark. Deer first. Yes. This is not what I expected. So, I haven't spent any money in it, and once I got to a point where... Okay, yeah, I can't go that way. Once I got to a point where, like, there is a lot of stuff for me to engage with... I know at some point I'm gonna start feeling the, yo, you're hard locked, but like I'm, I haven't felt anywhere close to a hard lock right now. Um, but that that first bit again is is a real slog. Game looks cool though. I do like the general fun fun uh aesthetic of it in many cases Alan Wake is this generation's greatest storyteller. <laughs> you do the fun little the fact that like literally everyone has a deer mask on is kind of creepy hey bud <laughs> Ooh. Making every page a true delight to turn in your fingertips. 
Alan Wake's a nice paper stock. With his choice of a hardcover book jacket made of a premium enamel stock with gloss lamination that is both tasteful and pleasant to the touch. Isn't that right? <laughs> oh no. Ilmo. Why is this still framed like your brother is still there? So fucking weird. There you have it. Alan Wake has done it again. This was the Costco Brothers Book Club. Cheers. All right, Elmo. Oh, can I go to the writers' room now? No, I still can't go to the writers' room. Okay. Can't go back there. All right. All right, let's focus on the game a little bit. I needed to read the ending to have a shot at changing it. I was inside Scratch's ending, a perverse version of reality. The townspeople brainwashed. Everyone and everything revolved around Return, as if it had just been published. That what it is. Well, I'm glad the laughing isn't happening on the float anymore. Oh wait, yeah, it is. It's just quiet. At Deerfest, oh, Leaks returned a genre-bending mixture of fact and fiction. Yo, somebody out here has got to have something to talk about other than my book. Not my quote unquote book. Alright, bud. Who else is gonna scream something weird about my book? Is it you? No. Hey, Elmo. What you doing up there, bud? I can't go into the hotel. Where, where am I trying to get to here? Can't go down any of the side streets. Hey, they're mostly naked spa guys. Hmm. I can trigger. Better I bugged it again and there's supposed to be a trigger right here. Oh no, here we go. Here's something I can click on. I could see the round windows of the writer's room in the photo. That's where I had to go. To rewrite the ending of Return. Hey guys. Oh jeez. Okay. Uh. Oh boy. Ah. Damn! Just stabbed me. <laughs> I was not ready for just sudden turn and murder. Okay. Yeah, I expected it would quick save there. All right, here we go. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I had the book now. I could write my ending to return. I had to 
get to the writer's room to stop this horror story? I mean... Scratch slash the darkness slash Alex Casey is gonna try to stop you somewhere along the way, right? monster of a writer and his final divine work of art. The novel return come true. It wouldn't stop here. It would keep spreading. So weird that you have a house in Bright Falls now. That's okay. I needed to reach the writer's room. Is this My not just was Scratch's insecure need for fame, for praise, drawn from my psyche? Is I this not just the fantasy crashing down around him? Old folks' home. This is just the old folks' home. Alice. Huh? What was that? Alice was dead. Was this a trap, or was Scratch torturing me? Supposed to go this way? Is that why Alice appeared? Oh, hang on. Y'all know me. Gotta go the wrong way first if possible. I guess if we have the whole book, we're not gonna find any manuscript pages in this section, huh? Yeah, I can't go that way. Okay, I think I'm supposed to go around... And this is going to be locked too. Yeah. I had to find another way inside. Wasn't quite ready for the screamy face, but you know. Okay. I still don't have a map, right? No, I don't. Okay. I can do this. If I don't get too overheated, I agree. Boy, howdy, I can tell y'all, I feel moist. Very, very, very much so already. My pajama pants I put on are already feeling just kind of sticky. I can feel my controller, like, actually getting, like... A little damp just from my palms in fact let's have some water shall we gotta make sure I don't dehydrate that's been my whole weekend is drink shit loads of water every once in a while take an extra shower I do have a fan it's not directly directly on me it's like It's further away than when I used to stream, but like I can still feel it a little bit. But just having the fan on me isn't really enough, you know? It needs a bowl of ice in front of it. That would help. At least theoretically. That's how I fucked up my like old bowl and stuff though was freezing it and putting it in front of my thing. I don't want to do that to my newer bowl. Okay, okay. Hey, Casey. Alright, we're just running. Oh, not that way. Not that way either. This area seems to have been uh, changed around from how I remember it somehow. Oh, there we go.
the really but he's very pushy rose right from the diner how did you how are you here <laughs> i'm here to save you silly i got your instructions uh -huh. every hidden message you left for me in the radio in the wind in the forums on my not rose red account. what no rose i haven't been leaving you any messages oh i get it Yes, Alan, only a crazy person would think you've been leaving them secret messages. <laughs> Wink. But now you need to get your butt upstairs, Alan. This shit won't write itself, no matter what William Shakespeare said. Right. Thank you, Rose. I'll do what I can. <laughs> it's kind of wild that she's like... somehow still here and sane and fine when literally everywhere else has gotten completely fucked upstairs the writer's room must be in the attic that's where the windows were what a goofy lady hey Audie, are you around hey How's it going, bud? Everything ready for the visitors. I'll come to wash the floor of your room next. All you need is water and Phileda. Water is the oldest pulp. Water finds its way. What water brings, it takes away. It can be clean or dirty. It can give life or drown it. Akti. I didn't expect to see you here, but it makes sense. Can you help me find my way? One last time. Mm, now there's a devil in the fist trap. Mm. Don't be spooked by it so that shit bolts start beating your underpants. What? What? <laughs> what did you... Okay. I'll get the door open. Adi, you're you such don't. a silly dude. There you go. Didn't we also need the clicker though? That like is a steak. Now comes the end of the rhyme. Thank you, Akti. All right. All right. Tis fine. All right, we're back. New scene. I didn't write the ending. I only had one chance to get this right. I needed an ending that took everything already in return and extended it into a conclusion that would save us. Mm -hmm. The perfect ending would work. It needs to include getting the clicker. It's such a sit down, there's not like a find a thing and then do the silly story plot board version. All right, let's sit down. The ending was an eternal deer fest that would keep spreading. Given time, Scratch would plunge the world into his nightmare. I had to stop that from happening. I had to write one more chapter for return. A perfect ending that would save us all. I was the only one who could write it. Everything depended on this. On me. Any second now, Scratch would burst through that door to stop me. Mm -hmm. Every plot thread dangled in my brain. It suddenly felt impossible. Something stirred in the room, coming to me. An idea. Oh, okay, we have to play the, the idea game. Clipses. The ending has to fit the genre it's going to work. In a horror story, there will be victims and monsters. There it is. The ending has to fit the genre if it's going to work. In a horror story, there's only victims and monsters. If there is Aero, they will ultimately pay a heavy price. I won't let the horror story take Wilkin and Casey. They were dragged into this. They need to survive. Non-negotiable. Not just them. We need to try to save everyone. Are we claiming that it's too late we'll for to Alice? The more people we save, the greater the cost. And the hero must pay the price. The scary
Gale's always so Alan's thoughts. considering himself to be the hero, sure. Well, let's try that first. Something felt different. I'd never seen myself in a vision before, but it fit. Saga and I were both at the center of this story. She was now my co-author. This was the beginning of the end. We were characters in a horror story, charging blindly towards the finale. We still didn't have everything we needed. This would not work without the clicker. Mm -hmm. End of chapter. That was shorter than I expected. I thought I thought we were just gonna be stuck in a big final chapter until the end of the game. All right, it's only been 41 minutes. I can go a little longer. I'm gonna get more water though. I've already done a whole cup. Give me a second. Ooh, uh, so sweaty already. 